what we compared to us is um, complex services. And what does it mean actually is we do, uh, we help people to set up companies, such as Mahat or LLPs. We also do a fair amount of financial advisory work. So what does it mean is that you know, we, we help people to value their company, especially for startups. And then we also help uh, for the investors to perform financial due diligence on their potential acquisition. Um, our target market are mostly uh, SMEs, so small, medium size enterprise. In terms of the legal identity and sole proprietorship, uh, the owner and business are actually the same uh, legal identity. So you are actually uh, the business, right? Uh, but for LLP and for Sandian Berhad, uh, it's separate. So it's a, it's a, you, you are actually, as a business is actually a separate legal entity compared to you. So what that means is, let's say, uh, you, are, you, you sign an agreement, right? If let's say you're a sole proprietorship, you are actually responsible for all of the debts and all of the liabilities of the business. So there is no separation between an owner and also uh, a business. In terms of structuring your business, uh, these are, the liability component is the, one of the most important components that you have to look into uh, because some people end up losing everything. Uh, if let's say they set up a sole proprietorship, uh, it's probably better to protect yourself uh, or your personal assets if you were to set up an LLP and a Sanyam Bahad. For LLP and Sanyam Bahad, the business holds the debt and holds the liability. So if let's say someone comes after the debts, they will only be able to come after the business and not uh, the individual itself owning the business. A lot of uh, our clients are startups, so they actually approach us, right? Um, they want to raise Series A or seek financing from their investors. And then this is actually particularly important, right? Uh, because uh, for a sole proprietorship, for example, it's very hard to raise financing because it's a sole proprietor, it's a sole trader, right? Um, so the growth of the company will actually be limited by the personal finances and the business profits of the, the owner itself. LLP or Senior Bahad, it's actually easier to raise uh, financing because for LLP, for example, you'll be able to raise uh, capital from new partners. For example, if let's say someone wants to come into the partnership, they'll be able to pump new funds into the company, right? Uh, so it's an additional avenue to raise capital for your business. And also banks, for example, will more likely lend a, give a loan to an LLP compared to a sole proprietorship. There is tax benefits uh, in terms of setting up a senior Bahai LLP compared to a sole proprietorship because the tax uh, rate is actually much lower for a senior Bahai LLP compared to a sole proprietorship, right? Uh, for example, if let's say you are earning 100,000 ringgit in a sole proprietorship, your tax rate is already 24%, right? Um, which is much higher than a Sinian Bahal LLP. Uh, because even so, you're earning, even if you're earning 600,000, you only tax 70%. This is not really about the compliance costs uh, upfront that will scare you. It's actually the, the, the taxation benefit that you will get um, that will be more advantageous to you if you set up an LLP and Sinian Bahal. Actually, uh, um, the, the, two, the two type of um, structure, right, is defined by LHDN. Uh, usually, when our clients do this kind of structure, actually, it's more for estate planning. You know, means actually they are really planning to pass down to their uh, kids or their families. Um, because uh, either way, because this, this investment is usually for long terms. So um, instead of holding on the personal name, they will, they will rather just put it on a uh, Sanjian brand structure and then have all the beneficiaries to become uh, shareholders. So everyone can you know, enjoy the, the fruits lah from, from, the, from the hard work of the founders. <laughs>